dude, he already did a couple craft commercials. I think they're on YouTube already. Well, he did one. It aired during the BCS national title game. That was the first one he did, and that is up on Craft's uh, YouTube page. Was it crack macaroni and cheese? Well, like, uh, like I said, like I said last week, man. If by some chance they ever do actually legalize drugs, he's the fucking perfect spokesman for dude, it. Dude, he is. He's the <laughs> kingpin. <laughs> I, I was I, I was pulled off the street and I had the opportunity, but I still decided to be addicted to drugs. So uh, I uh, 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 I uh, um, uh, I uh, <laughs> I hate you, Ted Williams. What's it, craft? Yeah, craft. I uh, uh shit myself. Yeah. <laughs> Ted Williams, eat a dick. And I hit the button on you too, cause that was too much. Yeah. I can't even play it. I gotta go off my computer. See now, this is a. See now, I said the name of the place and I couldn't say it. But can we actually play this commercial? You know what? We can't. Yeah. Well, You're that's correct. why I stopped you. Damn it. I want to hear yeah. Ted Williams. Because it voice. is a literally a commercial, you know. Yeah, it is. Do you want if you put your fingers to it? Fingers to what? <laughs> Your nine-year-old daughter? Oh my god! Oh, Ted Williams is bunghole. Oh my god! <laughs> Talk about my father, man. Oh I'm no! Down there and kick your fucking teeth in, bro. <laughs> what, your father? You'd rather me talk smack about your nine-year-old daughter than your father? I strain you out about that, bro. I don't understand why. Is he is he deceased? Up you have dental insurance, man. You're gonna keep talking shit like that. I'm not talking anything. Yeah, I'm asking you No, you I'm asking serious questions, Burnout. You don't have to get mad at me, dude. I'm asking you a serious a question. Bag, then, man. I'm his, asking you a serious question. His father, I'm not making a goddamn his, joke. His father is deceased, Frank. Is I remember deceased? him saying. Yeah, I don't remember him saying. Yeah, it. I'm he said sorry. it a couple weeks ago that his dad I'm passed sorry. away. I don't remember two weeks oh, ago when you talk. I don't fucking play, man. Wow. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you really pissed him off, Frank. Uh, I didn't remember his father being deceased. Sorry. Yeah, I remember. You know what, though? Unfortunately for you, Burnout, dude, everybody dies. Sorry. Everybody does. I feel almost sad now with this music and everything. I need, I need, I need the other record. Wow. <laughs> that's 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 a change of pace right there. Uh I'm tired now. Now I'm like, I go like, I'm like bummed out. Thanks, burnout. I didn't know. You don't have to be a dick. Come on. I'm not making jokes about that stuff. I never did. I made jokes about your nine-year-old daughter. Jesus Christ. Wow. I remember this song. Wow. This was a single, wasn't it? Yeah. I remember this one. Yeah, let's change the subject because I just pissed some guy off about his dead dad. <laughs> Sorry. The whole thing is just weird. Sorry. These are the kind of things we kind of need to have a, a sense of humor about because if not, you're just going to cry yourself to sleep. I didn't even hear you say anything about his father until he brought it up either. Right, right. I didn't know. I his think father you said daughter. Dead. I think you said daughter, and he misheard you anyway. Right, yeah. right. No, I said I asked him about his daughter, and then he yeah. said his dad. I'm like, what? Is your dad deceased or something? I don't know what you're talking about. Because I wasn't making any jokes about his father. Man, somebody needs to get that guy uh, up some trees real quick. Yeah, somebody take him some trees. It's all right, or, burnout. Or We're not mad at you. Just relax, dude, buddy. It'll be okay. Dude, I don't care what the vagina looks like just take it to the guy somebody take him somebody he can pay twenty dollars for to get off my case now i feel bad i do i, I actually feel bad i don't know if i want burnout to be a caller anymore i think i'm kind of upset with the guy i don't know burnout why don't you call us when we're off yeah, the air and talk dude, to us no dude call me on the air i ain't taking you off the air burnout. i'll talk to him off the air i'm not you can talk to him all you want off the air i'm not talking to you off the air no, man, I wasn't, I wasn't, I wasn't picking nothing. I wasn't picking nothing. I can actually, if I wanted to, in like half an hour, I could have playback for you. I wasn't picking nothing. I yeah. was making jokes about everything else but that. All I did was ask you if he was deceased, because I didn't remember you telling me. Ryan did. Uh, yeah, I, I remember from two weeks ago. I, I, I listened back to the show, so I remember. I take anti-memory drugs. Yeah. WCSB on here. What's up? 
Welcome back to the show. So, do you take my apology burnout? Did you listen to it? You need to know your limitations, man. It's one thing to joke around, man. I Don't wasn't, dude, I didn't. Like no, 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 no. You you are the one getting out of control here. I didn't need joke about nothing. My dad's fucking six feet under, man. You're going to start talking shit about my old man? I, have, 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 I talked any, have I talked any shit about your dad? At all. You need to know your At all. At all. Dude, I can play this back for you when you're sober. You'll love it. You're going to try talking smack like that. You're going to get fucked up, bro. Dude. Dude, relax, man. Yeah. He was he was making a joke about something yeah. else, and you misheard him. That's all. Whatever, man. Dude, I didn't make any jokes about your fucking dad. I miss my fucking dad, man. Don't call him fucking dad. Call him my father. You call dad, him that. Dad. Don't get mad at me. Come down there, bitch, your fucking ass. <laughs> wow, motherfucker. Burnout. Take it back. Just take it back. We can be done with this. I didn't. I didn't say anything. Burnout. And I won't take it back because I didn't say anything. And number two, I'm recording all of this. I don't care, man. I am a fucking cop, you asshole. Are you? You're a cop? I'm a cop. My name is John Kimball. <laughs> I'm a cop, you idiot. <laughs> Detective John Kimball. <laughs> <laughs> nice. So I'll, I'll let it go, man. It's yeah, just for... Yeah, just... Me, yeah. yeah, it's, it's all right, no, buddy. No, 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 no more about it, but... I, I, I wasn't myself, red. man. Why I'm so I was... I yeah, go red. ahead. Yeah, go please, ahead. Let him explain please. himself. All right. Let, we'll let him explain. I'm not taking any more callers right now. Because I, I, I don't want anybody... I don't want anybody... Turn the background music yeah, down a hair, yeah, too. I don't just want, a hair. I don't want anybody... There we go. ...trying to be shticky over this. This yeah. is... This is... This is for real. All right. Go ahead, buddy. Yeah, well... It was my 21st birthday, May 8th, 1995. Me and my, you know, I was going to be illegal, legal. Yeah. Me and my father, we were going to go out and party. We were going to go out and rip it up. We were going to tear it up. And then uh, I was having the greatest day. My, I think it was a Friday, if I'm not mistaken. But uh, we were going to go out and tear it up. And I'm at work. I'm having the greatest day of my life. And my mother and sister pull up to where I was working, my place of employment. And they're like, get in the car, get in the car. Something bad happened to Dad. Well, my dad, he had a massive heart attack on my 21st birthday. And that's that's kind of why I'm so fucking bitter. Yeah, I can understand that. You know, when people yeah, dude. Say, I don't like mom jokes, I don't like dad jokes, I don't like daughter jokes. That shit doesn't fl- sit with that shit. Don't fly in my world, man. How how old was he when he passed away? If you don't mind me asking. He's forty seven. Wow, he's a, that's really young. Yeah. He's a Vietnam War hero. How old are you, Burnout again? Thirty two. Yeah. Well, <clears throat> but uh, I'm sad now. I love my dad, man. I wish he. I wish I could have him another day. You know. Yeah. Wish I could have that day where you're supposed to go out and fucking tear shit up, you know, pound some beers, play some pool, you know. Yeah. When people, you know, people touch on that subject, it just gets me y'all fucking riled up. Well, don't worry, I wasn't picking on nothing, man. Don't worry about it. I ain't, I ain't that kind of guy. I'll pick on everything else about you, but I'll stay off of that. How's that? I promise. All right, man. All right. All right. All right, Burnout, we're going to go into music because uh, I'm sad now. So later, dude. I'll talk to you in a bit. All right. So, all right, Burnout brought down the house there. Yeah. Let's play something good. Yeah, where is it? Oh, this will work. You know what? You bastards on the phone, just piss off for right now. Yeah, call back in half an I'm hour. I'm not happy right now, bastards. Piss off. Wow. Well, I hope I, I hope Bummer Keith heard that because you know what, more shit has happened to people, I guess. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I don't know a whole lot about Bummer Keith though. You know what? After that segment, I hate Ted Williams even fucking more. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, Ted. Thanks. Blame Ted Williams for all, everybody's problems. I, I'm gonna blame Ted Williams for world hunger and uh, the world depletion of crack later. <laughs> <laughs> 